The CPS Energy rolling out the new smart meters one neighborhood at a time, and part of the push is to eliminate the need for meter readers on foot. But as the Defenders April Molina reports, you can opt out. But if you do, it's going to cost you. They are digital and efficient, and before long, these so called smart meters will be coming to your area. That's going to provide customers with a never before portal where they can go online or, or website where they can go on there and see what their energy use is on the next day basis. It's also going to enable CPS Energy to read your meter remotely without having to walk or drive by, saving thousands of dollars. When smart meters come to your neighborhood, if you opt out, you'll still be getting a new meter, a digital meter, but this one requires a drive-by meter reader. It's vehicle maintenance. It's a, it's a labor cost of sending them someone out there. There's a safety issue of sending someone out there. Uh, so, so those costs are still something that CPS Energy needs to recover. The customer will be paying the cost and then some. At $20 a month, it will cost each homeowner a total of $240 a year to opt out. It's not a number that, that we just made up. It's a number that we based on uh, looking at other uh, industry practice numbers. I think it's unfair. Really, I, I shouldn't, you know, I should have the uh, you know ability to do that if I want and opt out of it. Customer Richard Cruz doesn't agree with the mandatory opt-out charge, especially given he doesn't have a choice in which energy company he uses. They have monopolized this forever. That kind of forces people to only go with what they offer you. It seems like you're kind of trying to force customers' hands by charging an opt-out fee. Now we're simply wanting to ensure that the network is going to work the way we expect it to work. Depending on where you live, the sign up or pay up plan may come sooner than later. For the Defenders, April Molina, KSAT 12 News. And to find out which neighborhoods are getting smart meters over the next couple of years, you can go to KSAT.com for a map of the rollout plan of these smart meters.